I'm hidden right now. And, uh, 45% chance. Did it! We test our luck. I think we test our luck. Yeah? How, how cocky am I? Should I take these two? Oh! Nope! Should not have done that. Geeks, what is going on? Unite the Clans here. Back in your life with another episode of Fallout 4. It's been a while since I've got to sit down and play, and I'm excited to do so. We have just exited the vault where we dominated Skinny Malone and are now wearing his fancy clothes. Also, Piper is wearing his girlfriend's fancy clothes. We look pretty badass. Pretty, pretty badass. But I think the fighting is done, guys. We need to get back to Old Nick Valentine in Diamond City and see if he can help us find Sean. So, enough with these silly outfits. Enough with the goofing off. Let's go back to Diamond City and meet Old Nick. All right, guys, back in our regular gear. One of you guys had asked to see the world map for Fallout 4. I hadn't shown it, uh, and we need to fast travel, so we might as well take a look at it. We started, where did we start? Way up, up here. So, Vault 111, then Sanctuary, our little town, then the truck stop where we left our power armor, uh, into Concord, and that's where we met Pigar, Preston Garvey. I just kind of wandered around a little bit out here, and then I just checked out some stuff on my way down to uh, old... Uh, Diamond City, which is where we're headed now. Since going to Diamond City, we went much further east into the rough area like Boston Common. I don't want to go the whole long way back, so we're going to fast travel to Diamond City. We're in search of Nick. Old Nick Valentine. Nicky, as uh, Piper calls him. You know what? I was surprised when I met him and I was like, oh shit, he's a synth, right? Oh good, we finally got a not so cloudy day. There's, there's Diamond City for you. But then I was like, Piper knows this guy, and she was with me the whole time I was looking for him. I should not have been surprised. At some point, she should have said, Hey, by the way, Nick's a weird robot android, okay? Okay, we back in town. I think, Pipes, we gotta go straight. Straight to Nikki's office. Screw Takahashi and his expensive noodles. Whew, we're here. I don't know if Nick is going to be able to help us find Sean, but he's the best lead we've got right now. Are you here? Nick? Oh, he just got back. Oh god. It's really you. You're welcome. Well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's going to laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You say hey, no problem, buddy. See, and my job. Thank you. I got your back. Hey, happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time? Though, there, for you? the pretty girls, I do. I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but you deserve a reward. Plus a little something extra. You know... If you're looking for work, a worn you fedora. Work. You know how many of those I found? Sure could use a new the damn vault. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help. Thank first. you, you creepy right, faced SOB. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. You know what? If we're inside, I should be a gentleman. Put away the guns. And uh, you know what? A gentleman never wears his hat inside either. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing. Devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. <sighs> there was a man and a woman. They didn't say much, but I remember they called me the backup. backup. So we're talking a small team, professionals, the kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup. What else can you tell me? We're looking for my son, Sean. Yeah. He's less than a year old. Looks just like me, this guy. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Now that confirms it. 
This isn't a nope. random kidnapping. We knew that. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. A damn good one. A bad one. I want to ask about the. I want to ask about this stuff, but I. Either way, you gotta get down the point. Need to find find out about the right. kid. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. Oh. What did these kidnappers <laughs> Bald, like? uh, scar. Um. Uh, oh, there you go. One of them came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait, it couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Cornflakes? It's way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, Bald scar, head, reputation, scar for reputation, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, work, but no one knows who his employer no one knows is. Who his employer is? And he God had a house here in town, right? And he had a what? kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. Guys, we were frozen. This kid could be... Who knows? We got refrozen after they t they took the baby. So, like, even if he says it's like a 21-year-old kid... Uh... You said he lives yes. here? He's still I in need town? To find. They both vanished a while back, if I'm remembering right. But that house well, we'll check that there. shit out. Let's you and I yes. take a walk over to yes. Kellogg's last known address. Oh. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. Holy crap, guys. We have got a real lead. We've got a name and a location. And Nick is going to lead us over to check out the house of a man named Kellogg who fits the description of the guy that we saw take our boy and kill our wife just look at look at me I just found out the name of the man that is potentially responsible for the disappearance of my boy and the murder of my wife let's go Nick let's go Diamond City hey Valentine Kellogg's house is this let's way. do it then out on the road with old Nick we're going to check out the house of Kellogg. Nine to one odds says he's our man. It's more than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The MO is all him as well. Wow. From leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later. Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that. Wow. Off. He's right. These guys were pros. This is a cool part of town, man. Oh, wow. Let's go. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. Oh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's just be safe. That's one heck of a lock. Got something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? What? It's a master lock, buddy. Lock's really strong. No luck? Guess we'll need to find the key. See that platform in the distance? Near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. I'm on it, brother. I am on it. We might have to, guys, we might have to go super stealth. I think we'll be breaking into the office of the mayor. Out of the way, child. Work is to be done. Hey, uh, pipes? Pipe dog? Where you at, girl? Man, is she slow. Okay, elevator button push. See you later, pipe. Oh, he said, why don't you ask around at the bottom of that elevator? I'm just taking the thing straight to the top. Infiltrating the mayor's office in the middle of the dang night. Uh-oh. It's not really the middle of the night, is it? There's people here. Detected. Detected. Okay, let's just not be creepy and we'll just go say hello. The mayor's receiving visitors as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? Yes. So I can just head in and talk to McDonough? Go right ahead. His office is open. He likes to make time for everyone when he can. Hmm. She seems a little synthy, doesn't she? Mayor McDonough. 
Ah, yes. You make done of a bitch. Our new arrival. I wish I was in your shoes, getting to see our glorious city for the first time. Uh huh. How can I help you? Valentine wanted me to see. Yes, he did. He now. Some investigation, I assume. You two aren't trying to get me into hot water now, are you? Ha 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 ha. A man named Kellogg used to live in this city. I need to search his house. I see. Well, whatever reasons you have, I take my citizens' privacy very seriously. Even after they've left. I can't allow you to invade someone else's home. Please, Mayor McDonough. This man Kellogg yes. kidnapped my son. I should have my hat on so I'm more charismatic. Cool. Cool. Oh, thank God. I, I will do everything in my power to help you overcome this okay. horrible personal It's not a tragedy yet, fool. I remember Mr. Kellogg. Didn't like him myself. Paranoid. Never talked to anyone. I doubt you'll find him. Hmm. But do you? I insist you take the key to his old house. It's been abandoned, though. I'm afraid this whole thing might be... Yeah, I'm sure you cleaned out his belongings earlier today, you old bastard. So, we have managed to talk the mayor into giving us the house key. I thought we were going to have to pickpocket it, but we will not. Pipes, are you getting on? Yeah, you're getting on this time. Let's go down. Hey. Can do. I Get out of the way, for one. Pushed the button. Okay, this city is so cool looking. Okay, we just gotta go check out Kellogg's damn house. I think it's that one right there. Nikki V. Nikki V's staying up there. He was trying to get in, but it was a master lock. He couldn't break it. I couldn't break it. Oh. Okay, where? Yes. Let's go. Alright, we are back, and we are back with the dang key. Nikki, you impressed, Nikki. pal? All right. Head in. You do oh, we other. heading in, brother. Let's take a look around. Kellogg must I'll take have a something look. behind. Okay. Uh, nothing too good so far. Place yeah, you finished looking. You? Very. Handcuffs. Cutting board. Lighter. Lord. This guy was doing some crazy shit up here. Nothing here. Did you check out that desk? Think so. Look, two sleeping spots. That's a weird. Guys, that's a weird spot that to put a baby. Right. I think we were refrozen, out of and our kid grew up a little. Button. I don't think we're looking for a baby anymore. Whoa. What are you? Wow. Oh, Christ. Oh, look at this. All of a Merc's favorite things. Wow. Guys, we need to come back here and clean house. Oh, man. Cigars, booze, stim packs. If I wasn't over encumbered right now, Nuka Cherry. Oh, we got food d galore. Uh, cabinet. Oh, cool. Nick. Oh, look at that. All of Kellogg's favorite things. I don't see anything. Cigar box? Gwinnett Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, and cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. Huh. The silent routine isn't getting us anywhere. I wonder if dog meat could pick up the scent. Say, that's not a bad idea. Some dogs out there in the Commonwealth can track a man for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. You have to face Kellogg on your own. Just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. You can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Oh. 
Well, instead of Piper. I want you with me on this, Nick. Send Piper to the truck stop, I guess. We don't have a house in this town yet. Uh. All right. Yeah, we'll we'll see you later, Pipes. Get that bastard. Okay. Our show from here on out, okay? You say jump, I'll say how high. Guys, we have met Nikki V, and not only has he helped us get a strong lead on finding our boy, but he will now be joining us on our quest. Sadly, the lovely Miss Piper Wright is headed home. Headed home to the old truck shop where I keep my power armor. We'll have to make a base, guys. I am so excited to play through this storyline that I have yet to stop and work on any weapons or build up any base or anything, really. I haven't even dropped my stuff once. So I'm gonna take a break. You may see a couple episodes of that kind of stuff, but when we come back, we will be with Nikki V and hot on the trail of Kellogg. Thank you so much for checking out this episode of Fallout 4 Geeks. I'm Unite the Clans, and I will see you all in the next episode. Back, 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 back girl. Batgirl, let me get out the marksman's heavy pipe, bolt action sniper rifle, and I'll handle the situation. Nobody's here, idiot. There's not a single person here. Not a single one. Well, except for me and Piper, you're dead now, so you and Count.